So I'm sure you've seen this metal ring at the bottom of a compressor. And if you're a dumb sales guy like I used to be, you've touched it and probably got burned. Most people know it's called a crankcase heater. But a lot of folks don't know what it's for, so I'll give you a, a quick rundown. So compressors 101, the motor is located in this area here, and the compressor scrolls are located up here. This is your suction line, and again, your crankcase heater. So what happens is, refrigerant vapor has a tendency to migrate to the lowest pressure, which is a pretty common theme in nature. That's how things work. And what can happen when this unit's off is you can get refrigerant vapor migrating back through the suction line and going down into the compressor. And over time, if that happens, and you start the compressor, you'll have some major, major issues. You can Google that, and there's all kinds of talks about foam and, and things that happen with that. The purpose of the crankcase heater is to make it warm here so that the refrigerant wants to not come here. It increases the pressure and temperature of this area so the refrigerant cannot come back and accumulate into the compressor. So be careful if you turn a unit off for a long time, if you turn the power off to make sure you turn the power on and let it set for a couple days, one or two days is recommended before you start up the unit.